What's the fastest road to Glitterdelve? Glitterdelve Mine is a long march from here, many days on foot. Take the causeway instead. The Legion had an outpost not far from the mines. Must have been a causeway there, too, and I doubt the gate was ever sealed. We'll try to find the royal court, then. Is there anyone else who might join us? The Meisters. The merchant lords of Stonebridge. They'd be powerful friends. Friends? These people believe Jane's lies. They murdered our brothers and sisters. No reason to think they'll embrace us now. No reason to think they won't, if we show ourselves worthy of trust. At least the Meisters could tell us if any Legionnaires survived. So the Meisters govern Stonebridge. Are they nobility? Nobility? Far from it. They're the richest men in the city. Merchants, bankers, bureaucrats. Stonebridge calls itself a republic now. Ever since the old king died, and the people drove out the last Lord Mayor. Any idea where I can find the Meisters? Probably at the old mayoral office, on the main square. I'm told it was converted into a great public hall where the Meisters hold court. Jane is probably besieging the mines by now. The Meisters can wait. I agree. And if Jane is at Glitterdelve, we may have a chance to kill her and finally end the war. Up to you. Martin and I will trust in your decision and will be here if you need us. Talk to some old family friends. Spread the word that the Legion's returned. It wasn't so quiet last time I was here. Legionnaires, petitioners, so much noise.
30 years and they still haven't caught the dapper old gent. We all live in fear of him. Please do not litter or excrete in alleyways. Did you hear? The foundry's gone silent, and no one knows why. Please comply with all local laws and customs. Thirty years, and they still haven't caught the dapper old gent. We you all there. Live in you fear could use a better you. weapon. I can fold steel, craft a flintlock, or make whatever exotic weapon you desire. Yesterday I swallowed parchment and chalk. Later today I'll have a complete map of my digestive system. Frick. 
isn't Free it just the dreadful? Free the They've crowd. locked up an innocent creature. This is an outrage. You seem pretty upset about this. If the Krug didn't do anything criminal, it has the same right as a human or goblin. Humph. You can always judge a society by how it treats its downtrodden. Have you thought the Krug might be safer behind bars? My children would be safer if I locked them in the basement, but I wouldn't dream of doing that. I should be going. Thanks for your time. Carry on. Spread the word. Free the Krug. Free the Krug! Free the Krug! Free the Krug! Rejoice! The Meisters have concluded their session and the hall is now open to the rabble. Apologies. The preferred term is public. Ah, half a minute there. You came from the chapter house, did you not? Tell me, is it true? Has the Legion returned? Only a few of us, but yes, we've reclaimed the old chapter house. Ha! Let them laugh at me now! Meister Wolf, with his silly dreams of radiant children and prophecies of the Legion's return! You had a dream of a golden-haired child? A boy? Precisely so. Not a fortnight past. I dreamt that I saw a golden-haired boy standing at my bedside. He bade me get up and follow him. Tell me the rest of your dream. The boy led me through the city square, then up to the chapter house gate. Only, it wasn't dark and abandoned, as it's been for so long. It was clean and bright, lion banners snapping in the breeze, gates open wide as if expecting the Legion's return. Then I awoke, and there I was, standing in my underclothes in the middle of the street, gawking at the ruins of the chapter house. The child's idea of a joke, I dare say. Still, I knew it was more than a dream. <laughs> 